In this video, we show that an isolated photon cannot undergo pair production to form an electron and positron pair, and another body such as a nucleus is required to trigger pair production. Let us first suppose that the process does occur and then try to figure out its implications. An isolated photon that moves with the speed c produces an electron and a positron. This whole system is isolated, so the relativistic momentum should be conserved in all inertial reference frames. To simplify our calculations, we will choose a frame of reference, O, that moves with a constant velocity, such that both electron and positron recede from this frame in opposite directions and with equal speeds. Since electrons and positrons have same rest masses, their relativistic momentum will be equal in magnitude, and opposite in direction. Therefore the net momentum of this system is zero in this frame. Such a frame is called, center of momentum frame, and it is always possible to find such a frame for a system of massive particles. Let's see how the entire process unfolds in this frame. Since the speed of light is same for all inertial reference frames, the speed of the photon in this new frame will also be c, although its energy will be Doppler shifted, but still non-zero. We use the relativistic relation between energy and momentum to find the momentum of the photon which is the net momentum of our system before pair production. This comes out to be non-zero. but the net momentum after pair production has occurred is zero. This is a violation of the law of conservation of momentum as the net initial momentum does not equal the net final momentum. We therefore conclude that the process in which an isolated photon undergoes pair production is not allowed, because there is no way for such a process to occur such that the net momentum is conserved. The process can only occur if a massive body such as a nucleus interacts with this system to donate or absorb some momentum in such a way that net momentum is conserved in all reference frames.